guys welcome back to my channel for a Christmas decorate with me I'm so so excited really quickly in a minute we're gonna jump right back into earlier today before all this was set up but I wanted to let you guys know I am going to be decorating more and there's another video coming your way so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss my Christmas decorating videos this season this is my first season with my husband deployed so it's my first real holiday with him not here and honestly you guys he loves to decorate he does all of the hard work putting stuff together bringing everything upstairs so I realize now how much he actually did when he was here and I am sweating I'm tired and yet he's done this year after year without complaining and honestly I miss having him here he loves to tell me where to put things and what looks good so I had to wing it. I had to really wing this tree back here as you will see in today's video. But thank you guys so much for coming back to watch and let's get to decorating. The very first thing that I always do to get in the spirit, I have to have a Christmas movie playing while I'm decorating. I just feel like it's tradition. And the first Christmas movie that I watch every year is The Family Stone. I highly, highly recommend this movie if you guys have never seen it. It's full of stars, Rachel McAdams, Sarah Jessica Parker, uh, Luke Wilson, Diane Keaton. There's so many stars in this movie. And it's just about one of those dysfunctional family Christmases. So I just wanted to come on here and say that first. I had that playing in the background and this movie it gets me so in the spirit. I also wanted to let you guys know that today's video is in collaboration with my friend Allie from Wonderfully Allie. I'm sure you guys are very familiar with her. She's a mom of two boys and one little boy on the way. She shows how she balances motherhood working full time as a flight attendant and maintains YouTube. I love watching her vlog, seeing her go on all these trips, work trips, and fun family trips. And she's going to be on maternity leave soon, so she's going to have plenty of fun content coming throughout the holidays. So make sure you guys go visit her video. I'll have it linked down below for you. No, he wouldn't miss this in Christmas times. I absolutely was having trouble with this tree. I have never put up this tree before by myself. My husband usually does it on his own every year, but because he's deployed, it kind of leaves me trying to figure things out. I did not plan ahead for this. And at the end, you will see my tree was crooked and I had to leave it that way because honestly, I could not figure it out. likely is the last year for this tree we've had this tree for years and honestly I think it's about had it there were bristles just falling off left and right like piles of little bristles and I think that it's just gonna be time to buy a new tree next year but I think I'll just at least keep this tree and just move it into a different level of the house or a different area of the house but as you can see I just keep having to go back and forth because bristles just continuously kept falling Ooh, yeah, that's what we do 
We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Santa's gonna come and join us in this song oh, yeah. I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times So I realized it was way too short to actually dangle down but I really ended up liking it as a backdrop for the stockings. It didn't take away, it more just added to it. So I decided to go ahead and leave it up there because it does go with my little buffalo plaid theme that I had. And last year I'm not even sure if I even used it so at least I'm getting use out of it this year. Close, forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories And just in case anyone wonder where the twins are, they are close and nearby just playing while I decorate. They were actually kind of in awe once I turned the Christmas lights on. Their eyes just went right to it. And seriously, I'm so excited this year that we have two more little babies in our home for Christmas. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me. Hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh, and I've been longing to hold you close. Forget about everyone else. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh, oh. So here is a very quick overview of what the living room looks like. It is very similar to last year. Now, I am going to remove mine and Brian's stockings once I buy stockings for Winslet and Rafferty. So Paige and Anison will move over and it'll just be all four kids and the dog this year. And then this is my setup of everything else. And I have the ornaments and the toppers and all the decorations for the tree left under here. And tomorrow night actually Paige will be here to decorate. So that will be in the next video and also there will be the kitchen and the kids rooms and pretty much the rest of the house in the part two of this. So that's gonna be all for today's video, you guys. I will definitely have another Decorate With Me coming out here soon for the kitchen, the little dining room, the kids room entryway. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on that. And now go ahead and go over to Wonderfully Allie's channel. You will get more Christmas decor. And it's just this time of year that I just love so, so much. Even though our time this year is a little bit different than the normal, but you guys will love her channel, especially because I know a lot of you guys are full-time working moms. So is she, what a great way to 
get something a little bit different here on YouTube to have that full-time working mom. I just admire her so much. I think her career is so interesting. So go check out her channel and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Oh, oh, oh. Da, 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 da. Making our Christmas, Christmas.